First up, we head to Barden in Brisbane on one of those perfect sunny Queensland days. Today we are in leafy, ever charming Barden in inner city Brisbane and the house I'm about to take you through will show you just why this area is considered one of Brisbane's most sought after suburbs. I'm meeting with Ben from Bright Black Developments for a tour of this Hampton style new build. Well, this is pretty spectacular. It's a real showstopper and in a spectacular area in a beautiful part of Brisbane. Tell us a little bit about the house. Really lovely street, mm. uh, very close to all the cafes. We've put the Hampton style house here, so very on trend and fits in lovely with the street with the other Queenslanders. It looks like a new build. Was the, it just flat land when you bought it? It was. It was actually subdivided off the house behind us. Yeah, right. so, so this lot's 350 square metres, um, which is the way the area's going um, in a city. So we've gone a fairly neutral colour palette mm. um, and really accentuating the white and um, brings out a lot of the uh, traditional features. So mm. having the gables in a, a neutral grey and uh, having the white windows and doors and fence really makes it pop out. So tell me a bit about what I'll see inside. Uh, inside, plenty of natural light, beautiful oak floors, uh, lovely wine cellar and um, some beautiful kitchen with marble bench tops. Amazing, should we go take a look? Absolutely. So we've got our natural light stairwell here. Yeah, beautiful. All traditional features. And you come in with the big void, oh, wow. um, kitchen yeah. and dining. So much light. Yes. You're not wrong, it's no. yeah, very open, airy and light. Yeah. Which is pretty much what every homeowner wants, isn't it, really? Absolutely, connected yeah. to outside. Yeah. So do you guys design this? We design it from scratch, yeah, yes. Because right. so. I love how you've allowed for those windows to be able to look over the pool. Big piece of our houses is, is yeah. the pool and the outdoor areas connecting to inside. Yeah. This house has a really nice flow to it, doesn't it? And I feel like that's everything that's what everyone's looking for is just that nice flow and that nice feel how do you come up with the floor plan so with these houses we generally have obviously our open living yep. um, going out to our outdoor areas deck and pool mm -hmm. um, we try and connect the house up with the central void mm -hmm. um, which gives you continuity from downstairs to upstairs yeah and then the other key is to separate your masters um, from your kids bedrooms we generally do that with the living area and when you say masters, are you saying you've got two masters? That's correct. So oh. two uh, bedrooms here, two masters, oh. uh, both with en-suites and walk-in wardrobes. And is that a thing? We've made it a thing in part of our design oh. and, and product, uh, oh, no. whether it's for the eldest child or whether mum and dad come and stay or a guest. Uh, eldest it's good children are so spoiled now. They are. They've got it too good. I know. <laughs> so it's almost like a really good guest retreat as well. Absolutely. Yeah. And let's please talk about this wine cellar. How did you come up with that idea? So the wine cellar is a staple in majority of our homes oh, now. Wow. Uh, we've added timber feature walls and timber racks uh, to really, it gives, us, it gives the room a sense of warmth and uh, ties in well with the floors. It actually does. I've never seen that. I've never seen a wine cellar that's so sort of on display and sort of like the centrepiece of the home. Generally have them on display mm -hmm. um, for a bit of a conversation piece and it also breaks up the, the white of the walls uh, and complements the kitchen with a with a natural tone and natural colour. Yeah, you're right. It does break up the white of the walls. And I, I again, like I know we love our light, white, bright spaces, but I do think adding that warmth where you can is really important. It's quite yeah. a work of art. It is. Thank you. As you should in any Queensland home where we get to enjoy this amazing climate, you've included a good sized outdoor living space. Should we go outside and have a look? Let's go. So who is this house built for? So we built this house for everyone from retirees to young professionals. We obviously purchased the land when it was uh, vacant mm -hmm. and designed and constructed it 
to cater for everyone. This house actually didn't make it to market, so uh, it was purchased prior to. Wow. Um, yeah, so it's a very sought after area and it seems to be yeah. a uh, common occurrence. You got your carpentry apprenticeship and your builder's license quite young. Yeah. In the whole scheme of things. So at what point did you start Bright Black Development? So Bright Black was a recent addition to our company. Mm -hmm. We uh, started it to really label our brands and our development so people knew what our product was. Well congratulations, it's a beautiful home and I love all those quirky additions like the cellar which is a real showstopper so I'm looking forward to seeing some more.